Not too many nameplates are as iconic as the Mazda Miata in the sports car world. Since the debut, the vehicle has been praised for its light, agile handling, eye-catching design and unique driving experience. As we look toward the 2025 Mazda Miata MX-5, enthusiasts are facing a tough decision, is it worth sticking with the current generation, or should they wait for the highly anticipated next-gen Miata NE? Mazda. Mazda has a well-known strategy of running the same vehicle generation for 8 to 10 years, and the current Miata ND is entering its ninth year of production. The 2024 model received a few updates, but the core of the car remains unchanged. This has led many to believe that the 2025 Miata will extend the run of the current ND generation with no significant changes so the company can recoup the development and production costs. Stories from Japanese magazines suggest that Mazda may prolong the life of the current version until 2030, which has left many Miata enthusiasts feeling unsettled. While the idea of keeping the beloved ND around for a few more years is appealing to some, others are eagerly awaiting the next-gen Miata NE, which is expected to bring a major shift in powertrain technology. Mazda. The next-gen car is expected to embrace electrification, either a hybrid setup or a fully electric version. This shift aligns with global trends and regulations, but it has left many Miata fans concerned. The charm has always been coming from its driving experience, and there are fears that electrification could compromise the thrill coming from internal combustion engines. Until the NE generation arrives, Mazda is sticking with the current engine lineup, leaving fans enough time to purchase this car. The 2025 model is expected to continue offering the same powertrains that have been praised for their balance of performance and efficiency. A 2.0-liter Skyactiv G inline 4 produces 181 horsepower and 151 pound-feet of torque, allowing the Miata to sprint from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 5.7 seconds. Its high-revving nature and crisp throttle response make it a joy to drive on twisty roads and open highways alike. Available in some markets, a 1.5-liter inline 4 delivers 129 horsepower and 111 pound-feet of torque. While it doesn't offer the same punch as the 2.0-liter, it still provides a unique driving experience with excellent fuel economy. Both engines have been thoroughly tested and refined over the years, ensuring that the Miata delivers the performance and reliability that drivers expect. However, with the possibility of an all-new powertrain on the horizon, some may wonder if it's worth waiting for the NE generation. Mazda. If you're considering purchasing a 2025 Mazda Miata MX-5, there are several factors to weigh. Here are some pros and cons to help you make an informed decision. The current engine lineup has been a hit among enthusiasts for its balance of power, efficiency, and reliability. You know what you're getting with the 2025 Miata, and that's a driving that's been tuned to near perfection. The ND Miata's design is a modern classic. Its sleek lines and compact proportions have aged gracefully, and it still turns heads wherever it goes. If the rumors are true and Mazda extends the ND generation until 2030, waiting for the next-gen Miata could take a lot longer than anticipated. In the meantime, the 2025 Miata offers a chance to enjoy a tried-and-true formula without the uncertainty of what the future may bring. Even if the all-new Miata debuts sooner than expected, there's no guarantee that it will retain the qualities that have made the Miata so beloved. An electric or hybrid powertrain could change the character of the car, and some enthusiasts may prefer the purity of the current internal combustion engines. On the other hand, the 2025 Miata is expected to be largely unchanged from the 2024 model, which means you're not getting anything new. If you already own an ND Miata, there may not be enough incentive to trade up to the upcoming version. While the electrification of the Miata NE is a potential downside, it's also a reality that can't be ignored. If you're someone who values cutting-edge technology and wants to be at the forefront of the industry's shift toward EVs, waiting for the next-gen Miata might be the better option. Master. As the automotive industry continues to evolve, the landscape for sports cars like the Mazda Miata is not so bright. With SUVs and trucks dominating sales and stricter regulations pushing manufacturers toward electrification, the days of pure, lightweight sports cars may be numbered. Yet, the Miata has consistently beaten the odds, fueled by its devoted fan base and the unmatched driving joy it delivers to enthusiasts worldwide. The 2025 Mazda Miata MX-5 sticks to the winning formula, but it also raises questions about the future. Will the next-gen Miata retain the qualities that have made it an icon, or will it be forced to adapt in ways that might turn off its dedicated fan base? As we wait to find out, the 2025 Miata offers a chance to enjoy the car as we've always known it, uncomplicated, engaging, and endlessly fun. What do you think? Will you buy the 2025 model, or are you holding out for the big update with the NE generation? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching.